Hi, everybody. My name is Liz Faust. I'm a nurse practitioner in wound ostomy and continence management. I work at the Reading Hospital, which is a level one trauma center in West Reading, Pennsylvania. I'm here to talk to you today about the use of Bosch with VAC Veriflow technology. Uh, so for those of you that don't know what Bosch is, it's a powerful antimicrobial preservative and a wound cleanser. Uh, we utilize it uh, in chronic wounds, but also in acutely infected wounds. Um, it's pH balanced, so its pH is 5.5, which is optimal for wound healing. And the other great thing that it does is it can mechanically uh, remove bacteria and debris from the wound base. So um, it is helpful in promoting granulation tissue and decreasing the inflammatory response um, in the wounds that I've seen at least. Um, so for those of you that don't know what VAC Veriflow is, it's a uh, closed system utilizing VAC technology that helps cleanse a wound. So the Veriflow will instill a solution into the wound dressing that's closed, and then it'll remove it with a negative pressure wound therapy um, cyclically without a clinician having to um, pro or having to babysit that process, I guess. You have to program it, but not babysit it. So um, back Veriflow is great for cleansing wounds, solubilizing debris. Um, so the two technologies work really synergistically together. Um, what I'll say is um, the patient selection that I use it for. So 100% uh, acutely infected wounds. So a lot of our necrotizing fasciitis and Fournier's gangrene will utilize back. Uh, Veriflow with Bosch as our installation solution um, as a way of trying to decrease our OR visits and um, decrease the bacterial burden on the patient and on the wound. Um, the, the thing that we always use with Bosch is we um, use the Duo trackpad. So the Duo trackpad comes in the large back Veriflow kit if either cleanse choice or um, straight back their Veriflow therapy. And so uh, there, it also comes as a separate thing if you only carry medium kits that you can get that. So um, the other uh, patients that we utilize it on is if we have a patient that's being admitted with sepsis that has a chronic wound, we will kind of break that, that bacterial cycle with the use of Bosch with the VAC Veriflow technology um, to kind of reset them. And, um, you know, those patients have a lot of biofilm. And so anything we can do to decrease their bacterial burden is beneficial to them. And especially in this time of COVID crisis, trying to keep them out of the hospital uh, is very important. Um, the cleansing technology is also really important just um, in contaminated wounds. So we're trauma center and it's getting into trauma season up here because the weather is getting nicer. So, um, you know, open fractures um, or soft tissue injuries that potentially are contaminated or have soil based. Um, I know my friends down south have used it in patients who have had um, injuries along, like in rivers or lakes and things like that because. Uh, quite frankly, water, ocean water, lake water, the river water, brackish water, not sterile. It's not good for your wounds. I'll be perfectly honest. So um, as far as settings with Bosch, um, I, I really don't change my settings much at all. Um, I, I make sure that I'm dwelling for five to 10 minutes is really the important thing because you want to get the most benefit. So for acute wounds, I'll often do five minutes, but for chronic wounds, I do 10 minutes just to make sure that I'm mechanically removing that bacteria as much as possible and solubilizing that debris. So um, hopefully you guys will get an opportunity to utilize both these technologies together because I think the combination is really wonderful. Um, I think Dr. Fernandez, uh, out of Texas said it best when he, he talked to me that, um, you know, waterfalls are really great, but at the bottom, there's still that slime and that's a, that's biofilm. And so 
if you need something additional to help break up that. And I think the addition of Vash um, really helps remove that debris. And we've just seen outstanding results with the use, especially in our um, in our necrotizing fasciitis and our acutely ill population. So, all right, everybody stay safe and wash your hands.